computer science videos here today to show you guys in this tutorial how to directly save a Word document to a USB flash drive. Without further ado, let us start the video. So in this tutorial, you need to have access to a Mac computer, a USB, the software, Mac Office, Microsoft Word. So we can now go all the way down to the dock. Before we do that, let's just insert the USB into the USB port. You may be wondering, what type of USB do we require? For this video, we are using a 32 gigabyte Kingston USB. You can use any USB with any capacity, can be USB 2 or 3. The USB has now been inserted, as you can see on screen. We have about 24 gigabytes of free memory. We can now go all the way down to the dock, go to Launchpad, Go to Mac Office, open up Microsoft Word. Let's just click on a brand new document, blank document. Let's now decrease the size of the page itself. Let's just add some words. Computer science videos. Go all the way down to the dock again, go to Finder, go to my YouTube channel, I see an image. Take the image, directly add to the Word document itself, minimize or close Finder for the moment. Decrease the size of the YouTube channel logo. Right click, wrap text, tight. File, save. Now this is the part where we need to be careful. Do we want to save to the desktop? If we save to the desktop, let's just save. Quit Word. And now the document has been saved to the desktop, which has nothing to do with the USB. Memory stick, flash drive, let's just eject the USB. Remove that from the USB port, and we can see that the document is still there. Let's now insert the USB memory stick back into the USB port. Let's now open up computer science videos, the document itself. Let's now go file, save as to the Kingston USB. Let's click on save. Quit word. So we can now delete the document that is on the desktop move to bin as we already have it saved in the USB. Empty the bin, click on the USB. And there we have computer science videos, the document, let's just click on this. And here's what not to do. We have opened up the document Now, if we directly take out the USB, this will damage the file itself. We can no longer edit because its file location is no longer available. Let's just quit Word. Quit Finder for the moment. Eject the Kingston USB. Remove the USB from the USB port. And so that's how you directly save a Word document to a USB memory stick flash drive once we re-add or reinsert back into the computer, which we will do again. Let's just wait for it to show up on screen. Click the USB, increase the size of the final window, and there we have our saved file. We can work on this whilst the USB is in the computer Click on this, double click, wait for that to open. Let's just make some more changes. Hello, command S to save, quit word, right click on the USB, eject Kingston. Command E, and there we have 
the USB flash drive ejected from the Mac computer, the Word document has been directly saved on the USB flash drive. So we can now remove this from the USB port. And so that's it for this video. I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Thanks for now.